All right, so how to quit raid. There's uh, quite a few ways of doing it. You could just uninstall, but a lot of people uninstall just to reinstall later on, not really leaving the game. Um, and that's fine, no matter how you want to do it. But if you want to ensure that you absolutely just don't come back to raid, uh, I suggest deleting your account. That's probably like the best way to do it. Now, you can't actually do it on computer. For some reason on PC, you can't do it. Like it should be here on the in under the info tab. So let me show you how you get here. Home screen, you click your name, you go to info. It should be here, but for some reason on PC, it doesn't show up. However, on mobile, it does show up. Let me, let me see if I can, where, where's my thing? So I took this, this is um, from my, uh, what do you call it? My phone, I took the picture from my phone, a screenshot from my phone and under the info tab here, you can see you can delete your account. I don't know why it doesn't show up on PC and why it's only on mobile, but you know, it's there. I don't see a case where you would have a PC, but you don't have a phone. So that's a little bit odd. So I'm pretty sure if you wanted to just delete it from your phone, that's like the best way to do it that ensures you're just not gonna come back. Am I telling you to do it? No, but I'm giving you the option, right? Because a lot of people always say, ah, I'm quitting raid. Um, but then I get people telling me in the comments, like do a video on how to quit raid. So here I am doing a video on how to quit raid. So that's one way of doing it. Um, Blazin, shout out to Blazin, came out with a video. You should check that out too. I don't think I need to go in depth about why people are quitting and everything. Uh, but I did want to look at some of the comments here talking about um, his video here. I, I wanted to see what people were saying. So we'll, we'll talk about that in a, in a bit. Um, let's see. What was it? Oh, and there's another way of doing it right here. Check this out. Look at this. This is another way to quit raid. Just feed all of your legendary champions. There you go. Goodbye, Siffy. This ensures you're just never going to come back, right? And weirdly enough, let me tell you something. I feel like this is a good thing kind of because I've been I've been I've been seeing a lot of people who have quit raid come back to me in the comment section and tell me that they feel a lot better, that they've done other things with their life. So, you know, I, I just think it's interesting that a lot of people would uh, come back and say it's it's for the better that they that they quit raid. But yeah, this is another way to do it. Just, you know, start feeding all your legendary champions. So yeah, there's that. But okay, um, let's go ahead and take a look at what he's, um, what pe some people are saying here. So we have uh, the big derp saying, I'm still more pissed about the daily win a live arena match, which I've done. And if you're doing it the way that I showed in my video talking about how to uh, cheese, basically you, you lose like three or four fights in a row and then you get an easy fight after that. Uh, I, didn't, I didn't do it on this account because I haven't, I just, I don't know, I didn't feel like it. But this chest, um, I, I actually got some, uh, some these are probably like the best things here. Like, yeah, epic, or legendary books too, but the, the chaos and the ca uh, chaos dust and powder. I uh, just turned my card off. 100% not spending a damn thing, not even the gem pack. I spent over five figures, god damn. Well over five figures. That changed a few months ago to maybe 200, and now it's zero dollars. Everybody needs to do this or they're never gonna stop making these ridiculous changes, exactly. You guys need to understand, and I've said this so many times, they're not gonna care about what you say. They're gonna compare, they're gonna care about what you do. And I, I was saying this also, like even Krakens, even whales. Again, this guy's spending well over five figures. Like, even he's tired of it, right? Whales will get tired of this. I think it's time for no December, no dime December take two. Yeah, I've seen this. Um, people are saying it's time for no dime, uh, no dime December, but I don't think it works. And I don't think it worked the last time it tried to happen. And the main reason that that it doesn't work is because. This ideology, this this um, this push, is heavily consumed by people who don't really spend that much. Not saying everybody, but for the majority of players, especially those who are watching CCs, um, they don't they don't uh, amount to much in the, in terms of Polarium's eyes. Polarium only sees dollar signs. 
for the most part. So if you're buying a um, like a monthly pack and you're buying the monthly gem pack, that's like what 50 bucks a month. If you're a low spender, they don't really care. They care about the whales who spend tens of thousands or five figures, right? So no dime December's aren't gonna no 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 spending November's aren't gonna work either. You get what I'm trying to say? Tiger blood, damn. OG over here. This is the worst I felt about the game in three to four years. The problem is that you accept this. You complain, you complain, but continue playing, and Polarium sees this. Yeah, you can blame yourself for this because you accept the fact that Polarium is taking advantage of you. Of course, they're not going to change their ways because th uh, st th 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 statistics show that players still pay or spend money. Same thing, play and spend money. The numbers don't lie. The problem is for your, those is for those of you who still spend money, so there's no need to cry if you're not ready to make sacrifices and change your own habits. Yeah, 100%. Absolutely. Like, there's there's no arguing with this, right? I just said it in my last video, too. So, that's why... And and again, I'm, I'm, I'm human. If, if I was smart and objective, I would just completely drop raid all the way. But I, I just, you know, I can't bring myself to do it. And I've said it, I said it in um, uh, Sam Solstice's video. I was like, I feel like a father in a relationship with a wife who is abusive. Not this is I, hypothetical, but this is what I feel like in my in in this relationship as a content creator, as a as a raider, as somebody who plays raid. I feel like a father who sticks with his abusive wife because he still has kids. The kids in this situation being the community. I'm still here because of you guys. I'm still here because one, I enjoy making videos. I, I really do enjoy doing YouTube. There's no denying that. I, I really enjoy making um, YouTube videos. Part of me is can be done with Raid, but at the same time, I'm still here because of community. Like this community is, is like beyond awesome for the most part. And if it weren't for you guys, I still wouldn't be here. So yeah, I feel like a father who's who just doesn't doesn't want to end the relationship out of fear for uh, the kids. Now I know a lot of you guys have told me so many times that you're gonna follow me wherever I go, and I trust me, I hear you. I always appreciate reading that. It's really nice to see that no matter what I do, what I, it doesn't matter the game I play, it doesn't matter what what direction I take with this channel. I like seeing that. That's that's really cool that you guys are okay with that. Um, that means a lot, but yeah, that's, that's what I feel like. And, and, um, you know, I want things to change, but I, I don't know, but what I did start doing is I, I don't, I'm not going to do Hydra anymore. So, you know, that's, that's a, that's a step in the right direction. So you, you can't throw me in. You're not going to lob me in with those, those numbers, Polarium, because I'm not doing Hydra. Invested in Packmaster. Oh, fucking, where, where the fuck is Packmaster's dog? 24 hours before Taunt Nerf. Got one run out of him. Got the champs to fuse Makage, and now she's nerf. Crushes you. Why bother? Exactly. Exactly. Why chase champions anymore if they're just going to get nerfed? Why pay to chase champions if it's going to get nerfed? I messaged Polarium in the in in-game feedback, saying the pop-up that asks people what they think of raid, once in five stars. Told them they need to add a zero. They would get more accurate information having six choices. The ticket disappeared without response. Yep. Exactly. I believe it's time that every player send in the complaint ticket to the business regarding Hydra. I'm so close to rage quitting out of the game. I feel like I've done something wrong but I because I don't have Trunda. I've been sent to the corner and told thou shall not play without Trunda. Yeah. The only way the only way Polarium would care is if everybody quits or stops spending money. Y yeah. Pretty much. And I guarantee that if the great majority of whales suddenly stop spending, but all the free-to-play low spenders continue to go about their day, Polarium would change things fast. Like, I, I guarantee you, I'm almost willing to bet, like, I'm, like, 96% sure that, let's say, all the Krakens and whales immediately, just today, stop spending for a while, and that reflected in their analytics, they'd, they'd change something back real quick, right? They'd backpedal on their backpedal real quick. The only way um, they said they want players to use a more to use more variety of champions. What what am I doing here? I, I just said I wasn't gonna dive into this. I, it's like a it's like a black hole. Uh, let's see. Oh here, I just canceled my raid subscription. 
So that, there's another thing. Start canceling your, your subscriptions. Start backpedaling. Um, I'm trying to, I'm specifically looking for people who are saying how they've quit. That's what I'm looking for. Cause that's what this video is supposed to be about how to quit raid. So we've talked about, uh, deleting your account, uninstalling two years for a Polarian bug is a, is a quick fix by their standards. Unless it's something like switching HP with the sand devil or freaking Geomancer doing billions of damage. Instead of trying to make Raid feel more attractive, they keep pushing their players off game. There, we click the filter, we click some stuff on the filters, equipped, everything, sell all your gear. That's another thing you can do. All right, let me see, play him doing play him things. Uh, Darren, yeah, Darren said he's he's taking, he's just done, which is, I, I totally understand. I, I saw this video over here, I was like, oh, this looks like a familiar thumbnail. Thumbnail, it's fucking me. I quit yesterday. Thanks for all the content you created. There you go. I got out well over a year ago and don't regret it for a single second. This is this is exactly what I'm talking about. People quitting and saying they don't regret it. The normalization of spending ridiculous amounts of money is the main reason. Very few games are as bad as Raid. I believe they play the horrendous cost of packs as a badge of honor. We should all be embarrassed spending anything more than $20 to $30 a month on any computer game activity. I don't necessarily agree with this because I feel like, uh, especially if you can, um, oh look, it's also me. This is my, my, my other channel. Look at that. Beyond Horror Gaming. Um, on this channel, actually, one of my videos just reached 50,000 views. That's that's crazy. Anyway, um, I don't agree with this because I feel like if, if you want to spend your entertainment money on however you want to spend it, you should. But I do think that there's, you know, limitations. Like, if you're spending $10,000 a month, it's kind of like, well, <laughs> you, you know what I mean? But twenty to thirty dollar a month, uh, twenty to um, thirty dollars a month, even a hundred dollars a month, I think that's okay. Cause we we go out to eat, right? If, especially if you got a family, you're spending what two hundred dollars. That's that's different. That's not the best one for one. Never never mind. Forget what I'm saying. Never mind. DM this video to every community manager and player contact you have. <laughs> Meanwhile, King Arthur. Mmm, excellent. I deleted it after I heard Wixwell nerf was coming. Turns out it was much worse. Prepare for a great fusion and free champs to mitigate all the incompetence as they usually do. Yeah, this guy deleted it too. I've been eating long enough, man, my stomach should be full. I just ate, lick the plate, my buffet, lucky me, fuck you, thank